No. Medical marijuana appears to have hit another roadblock in the Kansas State House. Yesterday, a Senate committee decided to table the bill to legalize medical marijuana, likely stopping it this year. So Sean Logging joins us with the reason lawmakers gave for the move. Sean? Mike, Rachel, a plan to legalize medical marijuana continues to face skepticism and opposi opposition from some Kansas lawmakers, especially Republicans. After multiple days of hearings this week, the bill was tabled following lawmaker law enforcement testimony and some lawmakers say more time was needed. For advocates of medical marijuana, they say they're not done yet in the push for legalization. Another Kansas legislative session where medical marijuana most likely will be left undone. I'm trying to think of how to say this nicely. <laughs> Um, disappointment. It appears to be something that was just orchestrated. Cheryl Cumberg is a registered nurse and cannabis nurse who has been advocating for legal medical marijuana through the Kansas Cannabis Coalition. Mine was cancer in the family. Uh, one was in a legal state. The other one was in a non-legal state. And the differences were um, horrible for the family, the choices we had to make. She has spent the last several years working on education around medical cannabis use and supporting patients. They're not using a lot of THC. They're using just enough to mitigate their symptoms. And that's what we want people to understand is that it seems like legislators have one thing in mind, that everybody wants to get high. The tabling of the proposed medical marijuana bill came after lawmakers heard concerns from law enforcement and criminal justice representatives, including around the access to patient and caregiver registration. We believe the law must require any registration document to be in the person's possession when possessing cannabis and require it to be presented to a law enforcement officer on request. Sheriff Jeff Easter says another issue is DUIs with marijuana use, which he says was a factor in a crash that killed a Cedric County deputy last fall. How much is too high? We know what the rate is for DUI. It's over 0 0.08. We don't know what that is for marijuana. Cheryl says the advocacy will go on to see medical marijuana legalized in Kansas because of the impact she sees it having for patients. Sad situation that they are forcing people to become criminals just because they want to feel better and heal. The bill lawmakers were hearing was introduced by Republican Senator Jeff Longbine of Emporia. The bill sets out cultivation, use, and sale of medical marijuana, including the licensing for patients, caregivers, and dispensaries with a 10% tax on sales.